Welcome back to our Med Smarter Question of the Week, where we're taking a smarter approach to preparing future physicians. Before we get started, if you'll take just a quick minute and click that like button, and also subscribe and turn the bell on so that you'll be notified when we post new videos. Let's get right to that question. As always, we start with the last sentence of the vignette, and then we'll go back and read the rest. If this infant has met all her developmental milestones appropriately, how old is she? A female infant presents to the pediatrician for a routine checkup. Her father reports that she plays peekaboo at home, waves bye-bye, and will say dada. She cannot yet drink from a cup. She seemed somewhat apprehensive when the physician entered the room. She can lift her head when lying on her stomach. She can sit unassisted and stand with help. She has a positive Babinski's reflex. If they've met all the developmental milestones, how old is she? Take a look at these answer choices, read the question again, come up with an answer, and write it in the comment box below. So this question is asking simple understanding of developmental milestones. So we've said that they, this infant has met all of her developmental milestones appropriately, so she hasn't missed a developmental milestone, meaning that she would be older but showing a younger uh, development based on the milestones. Therefore, this is a simple understanding of do you or do you not know these milestones. So here are some of the milestones. Plays peekaboo, waves bye-bye, says dada, doesn't drink from a cup, that's to help you rule out some other milestones that she's not yet at, apprehensive when the physician entered the room, that's kind of a stranger anxiety, can lift head up when lying on stomach, can sit unassisted, and stand with help. So we don't have anything about walking. Uh, we know walking usually sometime in the 12 to 15 month range, a little bit later sometimes. Uh, so what that tells me is meeting normal developmental milestones, not walking, rules out anything beyond that 12 to 15 month range. So 12 to 15, 18, and 24 would be out just from that one particular uh, sign and symptom there. Having a positive Babinski's reflex, uh, typically that disappears right around your 12-month range. Um, so that also continues to uh, reaffirm that C, D, and E are not our correct answer. So therefore, going back, peekaboo, bye-bye, da-da. So fairly advanced, having some, uh, some words that they're able to do and, and understanding there. Uh, not going to be a 4- to 5-month-old. 4- to 5-month-old do not usually say uh, peekaboo, bye-bye. Uh, they can sit with some support, but some more of those motor developments the, um, and, the, and the verbal developments are a little too young for that 4- to 5-month range. Therefore, it is no longer an option for us. So that leaves B, 7- to 11 months, as my final answer on this question. And 7 to 11 months is the correct answer. As we described, going through each every one of these individual milestones, you can narrow it down to see where we have an issue or where we have a patient that lies on the developmental milestone chart. So we're seeing motor, social, verbal, and cognitive skills on all of these patients in that 7 to 11 month range. Okay, so we said they should be able to sit alone, they crawl. Uh, they stand with aid, so they'll be holding on to uh, a couch or a table or uh, someone's hand. Uh, this patient is playing peekaboo and having stranger anxiety, which is age-appropriate social skills. And then uh, verbal and cognitive skills like saying dada, even if it's not really uh, understanding uh, who dada is, but it's just having those words is a good milestone for that 7 to 11 month range. And like we said earlier, Babinski's typically disappears by around 12 months of age. So the presence of it in that 7 to 11 month range is normal and it is not pathological. If you found this material helpful for your studying, please like and consider subscribing to the channel. Also, share this video so that more people can benefit from it like you have.